Hey guys, uh, Joe from Sneaker Factory Floor and Park, Jeff from uh, Total Physical Therapy. Uh, here to talk about another common overuse injury, um, another one that is near and not so dear to me, I guess I was injured a lot, uh, plantar fasciitis. Um, so Jeff, why don't you walk us through it? Yeah, um, plantar fasciitis, there's a band of fibers underneath the arch of your foot and it really provides support on the body of your foot there. Good thing you're not ticklish and good balance yes, in there. thank you so much. Um, what usually happens is looking at the foot here, you're gonna have this nice band kind of going across there. Plantar fasciitis is really just a fancy way, way of saying those fibers are irritated. Those fibers usually get irritated from repeated over stretching. So it's gonna wind up with a lot of sharpness, a lot of discomfort, especially on weight bearing. Another big time people have a lot of pain with is first thing in the morning, that first step is excruciating. Because um, overnight, those fibers have a chance to kind of get back into that shortened position and you weight bear and you step on it and all of a sudden it gets stretched back out and all that pain comes back through there. Um, you know, some people experience a lot more towards the heel there, uh, right kind of at that calcaneus where the band inserts and originates from and kind of spans out like a fan for your fingers there. Um, what people typically find the most relief with though is first thing in the morning when you sit up, you know, before you put any weight on it, kind of stretch the toes, kind of pull that foot back and kind of get that stretch across there. So typically you kind of cross your leg and just pull up and over. Um, and getting those toes a nice stretch to the bottom there. We have this fancy little toy here, which is called the Amphipod Nano Foot Roller. Uh, we've had a lot of success with products like this in the past, and this is kind of an evolution of it and has been very, very useful for us. So the, this tool is gonna be great because it's gonna really kind of get those fibers in there. It's gonna help kind of separate them out there. And basically you wanna kind of elongate them, try and get some of that strain out of there. Um, the other thing I tell people to do is you freeze like a water bottle and you can roll that frozen water bottle on there after you've been running around for a while. It's not really gonna do a whole lot, but it's just gonna take the edge off for you. It's still gonna help with a little bit of the stretching there. But you gotta ask yourself, why are those fibers constantly getting strained, constantly getting stretched? So if that arch is collapsing a lot or you have poor ankle control, what's gonna happen is everything's just gonna hit the ground and kind of flatten out there. So we'll go back to our little bony friend here. I love that you have this yeah, store, by the way. You know, if you're, normally you should have that arch those fibers aren't gonna get stretched too much, but all of a sudden if you're constantly collapsing that arch or that foot's going flat or poor ankle control one way or another, those fibers are gonna constantly get stretched, constantly get irritated. Um, you know, best thing is get arch support. You know, if you're having that issue, that's what's really kind of going on there. But again, mechanically, you know, if your balance is off, you have knee issues, you have hip issues, um, it's gonna wind up causing a lot of that irritation there. But there are a lot of things you can wind up doing, trying for yourself like this. So that's it from us here at Total Physical Therapy, total-pt.com. Sneaker Factory Floor and Park. Uh, find us on Facebook, Sneaker Factory Floor and Park. And uh, we will check back next video and talk about the uh, ever-hated runner's knee.